if you were to give advice to somebody, or if you were to start over again, uh, you had no money, what would be the first 10 videos you tried to uh, to make uh, on a new channel? I guess that's advice for a new person. Huh. And nobody knows you. Yeah, and nobody knows me. Yeah, like, hypothetically, I have a mask on. And you also, I guess, don't have the wisdom. Well, if I don't have what I have in my head, then I would say just fail. Like, just a lot of people get analysis paralysis and they'll just sit there and they'll plan their first video for three months. And yeah, I, I'm any of you listening, if, if you, especially if you have zero videos on your channel, your first video is not going to give views. Period. It's not. Your first 10 are not going to give views. I can very confidently say that. So stop sitting there and thinking for months yeah. and months on end and just get to work and start uploading. Like all you need to do, this, this applies to people who have not uploaded videos but have dreams of being a YouTuber, is make 100 videos and improve something every time. Do that. And then on your 101st video, we'll start talking. Like maybe you can get some views. But, you know, your first 100 are going to stop. There are very freak cases like Liza Koshi or Emma Chamberlain who have really good personalities and it doesn't take them so as many videos. And it's just like, people who are seven foot five and making the NBA. Like, yes, there are free cases you can find, but for the average person like us, you know, who don't have these exceptional personalities and, you know, backgrounds in filmmaking, just make a hundred videos, improve something each time, and then talk to me on your 101st video. Well, the improve something each time is the tricky one. How do you improve something each time? The second one, just, I don't know, put more effort into the script. The third one, try to learn a new editing trick. The fourth one, Try to figure out a way that you can have better inflections in your voice. The fifth one, try to you know study a new thumbnail tip and implement it. The sixth one, try to figure out a new title. There's yeah. infinite ways. That's the beauty of content creation online. There's literally infinite ways from the coloring to the frame rate to the editing to the filming to the production to the jokes to the pacing to every little thing can be improved and they can never not be improved. There's no there's literally no such thing as a perfect video. So if you knew everything you know now, yeah. but no money. Step one would I just brainstorm like okay I don't have money. What are some viral things? Like, I mean, you know, the first thing that comes to my mind is something as simple as when I count to 100,000, which yeah. is what I did do when I, I was poor. <laughs> um, and like that worked. But like, what's something like that I could do that would be even more attention grabbing? Yeah, you were, as part of the brainstorm, you would throw out a lot of ideas and people would throw out a bunch of ideas. And one of the questions is, is this even doable? Right? Yeah. First off, come up with ideas you think would do well, and then ask yourself later if they're doable. Yeah. Because there's there's different ways you can accomplish something. Don't be cynical about the doability of stuff. Yeah, because there really are so many different ways you can accomplish a goal. Like um, when we give away an island, like we gave our hundred million subscriber an island. Yeah. You know, you can't find private islands that you know don't look like shit for less than ten million dollars. So this isn't doable, right? All right, the idea doesn't exist. Not doable. Exit off. But then, you know, you dig into it and you, you know, find different alternatives and you find, okay, well, what if we just buy a $2 million island that sucks and then spend a million dollars, you know, importing some sand, let's build a beach, let's import 300 trees, let's build a little bit of canal, let's cut some paths, boom, now it's a really nice island, but it's actually affordable because we don't have $10 million to spend on a video, but we can afford to spend three and a half and lose whatever a million dollars on that video. So like, that's an example of like, yeah, if you just went off the gut test, you'd be like, this isn't doable. You know, every island's $10 million. We're, we're screwed. Like, if we go cheaper, it's just a terrible island. No. And so, if you like, there are so many different ways you can achieve what you want. You really got to push through no's, which not a lot of people do. You have to have like a more of a dominant personality and just a willingness to, um, when people tell you it's not possible, just actually go through all the variables and eliminate them all yourself. Have a stubbornness. And a resilience to failure, maybe. For what we do and creators online, it's very imperative that you have that a no isn't a no to you. Like you really have to like think and um, and just like we we take a personality test and like just having a, a dominant personality is a better indicator that when someone tells you, oh, there's no way you're gonna build a brick wall for under 100 grand, you know, you'll be like, okay, and then still go check the next <laughs> ten vendors and yeah. you know figure it out.